Good morning students, I am Dr. Benson Benjamin, the CEO of MITPG. Today I am before you to give a mission statement and mission statement of MITPG. 17 years back when MITPG was started by our founders Dr. Ashwath and Dr. Vijan, MITPG was meant to be a coaching institute that caters to every single aspirant in our platform to crack their dream score, their dream PG uh, in the then AIP GME exam as well as the All India AIMS as well as JIPMER exams. From that day we have been we have been bagging the top 10 ranks, 100 ranks across the multiple exams over the years. But then as time passed by, we understood that the most important factor that an institute caters for, the most important uh, like the point that an institute caters for is not the top ranker because irrespective of the institute, a topper will always get the top score. But those students who are in that institution with the resolve and commitment to study, achieve their dream score. They are the actual group needs the effort and the, the help that is required to reach the target score. In this context, MedPG decided that we will, we will go into a different model of learning where there is, a, there is a class, like a faculty comes and teaches you one of the best content in India for the particular subject. And most importantly, after listening to the class, you as a student needs time to study that, right? You need to sit with your notes to, to you know, understand, read, uh, fill up your concepts and make sure that you're clear about the topic. So this needs time. So after the class, you are given enough number of times, for example, four days of anatomy classes at 9.30 to 6.30. And then you have another four days of full days to study the notes given by our faculty. Along with that, we make you practice questions because Ultimately, your exam is an MCQ exam and you have to solve MCQs. So learning is a process of solving MCQs also. So you are solving MCQs with your faculty uh, and the materials given over the next four days. And on the fourth day evening, you have given a small test of around 50 to 100 questions to make you understand that after spending four days of learning in class and four days of self-learning, you have been able to achieve an X percentage, let's say 70%, 60% or 50% of questions solved by you at the end of that exercise. So this gives you a confidence, right? This gives you, this makes you an understanding about the measure in which you have to put more to reach a higher score or actually reach your target score. Or you might know where you're going wrong, which are the methods you're going wrong and what is the problem at the core of your learning system. So from day one, you're able to improve and change to the next subject. So the next subject, let's say it's a two days anesthesia class, then you have two days holiday and then an exam. So this exam will, will tell you that, okay, in anesthesia, I have put so much effort and this is the score. So if I have to go to a higher score, this much more effort I have to put in and reach there. So after that two or three subjects, we give you a cumulative test. A cumulative test is like three subjects together, you have cumulative one. And then this will show you that if after learning one subject, there will be a lot of bias. But when three subjects are coming together, if you're still able to hold your percentage or hold your position in that class, you are still on the right track. If not, you need to actually go back and revise and understand where you're going wrong in your further learning methods. So after the three, then it comes the six cumulative, then comes the nine cumulative, then comes the nine, the 12 cumulatives. Like that by the sixth exam of cumulative, you would have actually touched a grand test. So in a four and a half, five months time, you are finishing the entire 19 subjects as well as a, a cumulative test series of six exams to reach or culminate in the grand test at the sixth month beginning. So this grand test from that day will show you where you are at that particular point compared to the entire students in India. Let's say your dream score is 550 and at the sixth month you are in a score of 450. Now you know there is a gap of 100 marks, right? Solving or bridging this 100 marks to reach your target score is what revision is all about. So everyone tells about revision. You have to read twice, thrice, four times. I've even seen and heard students saying that they have done sixth revision, seventh revision. But when I check the grand score, they're hardly having 350 or 400 marks. So the discrepancy is here is that the students doesn't know what the revision stands for. Like it's not about taking your notes and reading it over and over again or taking your, your questions and solving it again and again multiple times just to do the same thing over and over again. It's about finding what you're going wrong, where you're going wrong, filling that areas up by reading it up again or solving questions there and improving your score. You know, a grand test is a review tool from which you learn to improve your score further. So in this context, in the sixth month, when you reach the grand test, it will continue for every seventh day. And between these seven days, we will make you revise two to three subjects according to the size, right? 
So the two to three subjects revision will keep on increasing your grand test score from test one to test two to test three to test four. So each week your weakest subject has to be revised, improved and your scores keep on improving. So next two and a half, three months at MedPG is a revision time for you to actually understand where you are at the end of the regular class and you have let's say April or May the exam. So till that day if you are each and every week you are improving and bridging your gap towards that 550 score or 650 score or the top ranker score that happens as a process. This entire vision of, of a regular program is to identify where you are on day one, give you the best nation's best faculty coming and teaching you the content and that too concise crisp notes to help you read and consolidate that. After consolidation, you are given time to practice yourself and solve questions and given periodical cumulative tests to make you understand that you are on track or if you are deviating to remind you buddy, hey you are out of the track, please come back. So that process and finally you reach your full 19 subjects notes and content revise from day one of your revision with a vision of where you have to reach and how you are going to bridge that gap. So this whole process of learning at MedPG happens in the one of the best ecosystems available for you. It's simple, you have a classroom of 200 students, just 200 focused, connected with the faculty and you have a wonderful 24-7 reading hall or a, or a library kind of a thing where you come sit and take a place for yours. You have your cabin, right? You, you sit there and declare it as your country, put a visa, you put your own rules, whatever you want in that area, sit there, fix there and study for the whole duration. Take it up forward so that, you know, everything is like you can stick paste it, you can put your deities photos, you can do whatever you want except for drilling and burning. Whatever you want to do, you can do it there. That is your place in that campus to sit and study an ecosystem, uh, an environment where everyone is studying and you are there studying by yourself in that spot. So that is uh, the, the ecosystem that we provide and the mess and the rooms and everything is comfortable and cozy so that you are in that place focused in one direction with all fellow aspirants towards one goal, reaching your dream PG score. So this system, this ecosystem that we have designed, designed over uh, MedPG is what makes us special and unique compared to every other platform. We believe every single platform gives the best content, the best faculty, the best teachers, but MedPG, we differentiate by making sure that you are getting the best faculty as well as the best environment and the right guidance to reach your target score. So this is the mission and mission by which we started MedPG and scaling it up right from Coimbatore to, to Hyderabad to Chennai to Bangalore to, to now to Delhi. You know, every single place where we went, we went houseful, we went completely booked out because of this reason. We made sure that it is an ecosystem and we kept our promises. See, ultimately what matters is you. See, whatever we do, whatever we say, whatever content we give, whatever exams we give, whatever ecosystem we make for you. If you utilize it properly, if you commit yourself to that system, you focus yourself, push down and study really, really hard, you will reach your goal. Irrespective of the institution, you go to any institution in India, if you are ready to commit yourself, work hard, you will reach your goal. So ultimately, as an institute, we would say that we are the ecosystem that drives you to study. But you are the hero that actually puts the effort and gets the rank. And we don't owe your rank. It's you and your effort and your commitment that takes you to your rank or your dream PG score or a dream PG seat. Realizing this, MedPG has always tried to stand by that every single aspirant. Whether you are at 100 aspiring for 400, whether you are at 200 aspiring for 600, whether you are a person who is targeting for top 10,000 rank or top 100 rank, we always believe it's our job to give you the methods, the tools and systems to reach that score and rank. But the work, the, uh, the effort comes from you and you are the hero at MedPG. So uh, rightly we say that the, the slogan of MedPG, you know, it's very simple. Every single student in our campus is our priority. Okay, thank you.